Hi there, this is Michelle V. Hill with the University of Wyoming Extension, and I'm gonna be doing my Money Minute, and today I'm gonna to talk about a bill calendar. Here's an example of a bill calendar. You may be able to avoid late fees or other consequences of missed or late payments if you set up a bill calendar so you can see when your payments are due. Most people have reoccurring bills and expenses like rent and utility, car payments and insurance. And most of these bills have a fixed due date. If you're late, even by a few days, you will likely pay an extra fee. You also may risk a negative entry onto your credit report. Figuring out which bills to expect helps you plan to have enough money on hand. Some people find that thinking ahead helps reduce the stress when the bills arrive. What to do? I would gather all of your bills that you pay in one month or use the information from your spending tracker. You want to remember to include any bills that are paid automatically. Then you write the date down when you must send the payment or when the money must be taken out of your account in advance of the due date. I would say seven days in advance that you could write it down. If you're paying by mail, mark the due date at least seven days before it's due. I just said that. For an in-person or an online bill, uh, mark two or three days before the due date to ensure that you're not late on the bill and then have to pay a late fee. Then you wanna write down the name of the company or the person you owe the money to and the amount that's due on the date um, on the on the date the bill must be sent to arrive on time. Then you want to put it on your calendar where you can see it every day. Um, you could also add in your uh, sources of income as well when you get paid. So that could also help you trigger um, you when you get paid so that you could save your money and put it back. Uh, here's an example of a bill calendar and I see it every day. So here it is. It has when certain things are ready to go. So yeah, you can uh, get a calendar anywhere, a lot of free calendars out there. So I would recommend just getting a free calendar from somebody and putting it in a place if you, if, if it's private, then don't put it out where everybody can see it. Put it in a place where you see it every day. All right, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I hope this helps. Have a good day.